Hello everybody and welcome back to Skyfacadies! Today me and Ash are back again with another challenge video and as you can see by the thumbnail or the title we're going to be doing the train challenge! Yay! Oh! oh. Poo poo! Poo poo! <laughs> <laughs> so, exciting news! They've added a brand new tool which is absolutely incredible. This little thingy here is called the welding tool. The welder. This little beauty will save many hours of heartache and annoying rage quits and everything like that because this allows you to basically connect two things together. So if you've ever been working on a project and something's gone wrong and you've accidentally like knocked a piece off, there was no way to stick it back together again. It was just so annoying. You had to rebuild like the whole thing. So this little beauty here sticks things together again. Yeah. It's like super glue. It's, it's like super, <laughs> super glue tool. Yeah. But pretty much you can use this now to make, um, you know, things stick together. And we're going to do the train challenge because, as you know, old steam trains, we're not going to go too much into it. So they use kind of like the piston sort of motion and then you did the bar moves, which moves the wheels. <laughs> very technical there. It's very technical. <laughs> very good description. <laughs> Pistons move the bar and Yeah, the bar forward. moves the wheels and the, the steam with the pressure and, the, 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 and then all that stuff. So, yeah, we're going to basically uh, make a train. Uh, it's going to be using the bar and it's going to move the wheels, and that's pretty much it. That's pretty much what me and Ash are going to do today. Yeah. Um, so, yeah, I'm just going to quickly run through the challenge, and then we're going to get started because, yeah, we want to basically get this going. So we're going to build the train. We're gonna, it's going to be a race. We're going to start, and then we're going to have to grab these boxes, stick them to the back of our little train, move on, do the same with these three objects. When we hit the end, we go all the way back, and it's first one to hit the backboard wins so it should yeah. be pretty good should be good to go hopefully we're gonna have two little inventions that work at the end of this hopefully <laughs> Ho hopefully yeah <laughs> hopefully <laughs> right so are you ready mate i've got pretty much everything i need so um i'm good to go i, I think i'm ready yeah um, you're ready you know you're yeah, ready i'm ready ready, ready. Let's do this yeah right Let's so do this. i'm gonna mute ash as always you guys know what we do yeah. Um, and yeah, I'll see you in 10 minutes, mate. Okay, see you in 10 minutes. Yeah, the best train win. Are you ready? Is it Ash ready? Yes, okay, ready. Three, two, one, and go. And Tyler, I've just pressed the timer now. So let's get going. So this train is going to be five wide and then one with the wheels. Oh, I just... Look at the wheel. It's, it's flat. I don't know why I'm so, like, like amazed by this. But anyway, we're going to make this out of wood because it's probably going to be nice and light uh, and stuff like that. So let's put ourselves a lift down. We're going to make this five wide, as I said. And that's three, and then four, and then five. Uh, we didn't actually explain, but the minimum amount of wheels we can have is four on each side. So, yeah, let's do this. We're going to go for four small wheels. So let's pop this on here. So one. I want to try to make them quite close together. We don't really want, like, a huge, massive train. Let's do, like, a two-block gap. So one, two, uh, and then we need to do the thing there. Oh, no, we need to do one more. So this is going to be kind of like a, a bit of a bigger train. Um, so I think this should be fine, actually. If we just do uh, one there and then pop this on. And then this should be pretty good. I'm so excited to show you guys how it works. Because I'm not sure um, if you've actually seen it in, you know, proper working before. Because it's actually quite a new little update they've brought out. I think it only came out yesterday, I think. So, yeah, it's pretty exciting. It's pretty good. Um, it's going to save us a lot of creators. Um a lot of heartache because I can remember I used to build quite a lot of creations when I was just messing around before I actually started recording the challenges and there were so many times when I actually made something and accidentally just pressed something off and it completely broke the machine in two and it was super annoying but yeah now they've got something that fixes it so I'm gonna run you through the tool we can actually make the bar out of like concrete or a tile block I want it to be tile we don't want it to be all wooden boring so let's do this so what you do okay is you bring this piece like that, bring this piece together, and then what this does is it kind of has two halves. The welding tool, if you click on one and drag it to the other and let go, it welds them together, which is pretty awesome. So we're going to do the same all the way along here like this and all the way along like this. So now, if I should just drag this together and then this to this, and then this is one solid bar, and yeah, this should be pretty awesome. So we're going to do the same with the other side. And that is the train done, pretty much. The front of the train done. 
We're going to have a little bit where we can store uh, all our storage. But this is a race. So I want to make sure that I get everything uh, down to a T. I.e., I want to make sure that everything works to have a working train. But, yeah. This welding tool is amazing. If you guys have got any suggestions for what we can do for the next challenges with these uh, welding tools, then yeah, let me know because I'm sure there is some pretty awesome things you can you can do with these things. They're amazing. So yeah, let's get rid of the ramp now. We're going to stick an engine on it. Ash has gone for the thin, but I don't, is it going to be able to fit on the tracks? <laughs> not for gears. <laughs> ah, ooh, that's a good point. I need to actually check that this will go on the track. I'm, I'm hoping it will. Yes, look at that. Perfectly in line on the tracks. We are doing this, guys. We are doing this. So let's go for... I was going to go for a gas engine. Um, but I think I might do for this because it's quite a slow engine. And I don't want this thing to derail. So I think this should be pretty good. So if I put this on here. And we're going to connect it to like a seat or something like that. Let's just do like a driver's seat. I'm going to put it three because it's symmetrical. Oh, no, these are the four ones, aren't they? Yeah, okay, these are symmetrical. We need uh, the little driver's saddle. That's what we need. So let's pop this... Uh, should we pop it, pop it at the front of the train? There we go, that's fine. Uh, so what we need to do now is get our little connect tool out. Uh, make sure all these little bearings are going the right way. And um, we're just going to connect this engine to this. Now, I'm not sure how many bearings we can actually put on one engine. I think it's four. I'm not sure. We'll find out in a minute, though. We'll definitely find out. So, yeah, this is going uh, the right way. Yep, that's fine. If we just come over to this side and double check. I could go for another engine. Uh, okay, yeah, I'm going to have to go for another engine anyway. So we could plunk one on top. That is absolutely fine if we do the same. Wait a minute. This is the wrong engine. There we go. This is fine. Like that. And then we do the other side with a load more, uh, a load more power. Because I think that would be good. If we both get them working at the same time, then we'll have double the power. So we just need to, like, switch these rotations around. And then it's all going the right way. We connect this back towards the driver's seat. And then I think our train is pretty good <laughs> if we remove the lift. Where's the lift? Okay, it's right underneath. This is probably going to be pretty awkward. So let's get rid of it. There we go. <laughs> all right. Are we ready for this? Oh, look at the power. <laughs> not very, not a lot of power. Okay, let's put it on, like, two. Let's put it both on, like, two. There was a problem there in the case. I was pressing... I was pressing backwards and it went forwards. Have I done something wrong here? I need to zoom out. Oh, look at this, though. It's a fully working train. This is pretty awesome, though. But I just got to remember that backwards is forwards and forwards is backwards. But this is fine uh, in the terms of train. It's a little bit slow at the moment. But, you know, what? I don't really care about that. I'm not too fussed at the moment. So what I might do now is we might actually... Just show off the welders tool because what I need to do is I need to make myself a little bit of a carriage at the back. But So what better way to do it is to make it separately and then weld it together. I'm hoping this is going to work. But yeah, same sort of pattern, I guess. We just need to do it five wide like so. We need to have enough room. So I'm just going to make it... I think that'll be fine. If I just stack it, then I should be all right. So yeah, we'll do the, the little things here and here. We'll do a couple of bearings. We'll get the wheels back out. And then I think we should be good to go. So let's do a wheel there. Jump on the other side. We, we, oh, we, I think we might have time to actually make this look like a bit of a train. You know what I mean? Because normally in scrap mechanics, it doesn't really look like what it is. Do we attach trailer now? Oh, yes! Do it. <laughs> uh, yeah, I should do it. <laughs> See, we put that there. Wait, have we still got the... Okay, the lift's not on anymore. We need to get this on the lift. There we go. Okay, and let's do this there, this there. And this should be good to go. See, that's what I was saying is normally when we do it, it looks nothing like what it is. It sometimes does, but normally it doesn't. So what I can do now is I can spend a little bit of time uh, actually working on the aesthetics and making it look all nice and pretty and beautiful. So, yeah, I mean, I guess this is fine now as long as we just take this away. And then if I just grab the welding tool, I kind of want it in the middle. Uh, actually, what we can do is we can add a little bit at the back just to pull it. Like this. Ah, oh, this is going to be good. If this works, this should be amazing. Please, I'm showing this welding tool off. Please make it work. So if we pop this, grab it, and attach it. Oh, look at that. That is what the welding tool can do. That is brilliant. That is super brilliant. And, oh, it's just, well, it's just amazing. It's just absolutely amazing. Oh, it's poetry. Poetry in motion, guys. The welding tool is absolutely fantastical. So, yeah, let's do um, a little bit of a, a nice carriage now. We've got a little bit of time, so we can make this look absolutely fantastic. So, let's put ourselves a back on. 
like this. Let's put ourselves some sides on. And let's give it a brand spanking paint job. And let's do the same with the train, actually. We've got enough time now. We've pretty much, you know, made it look okay. The only thing I need to do is turn the power up on the engines. Or I could probably make the engines faster, but I'm not really that fussed, to be honest with you. I think that the engines will do fine. Uh, I just need to try and bring this over here if we can. Come on! Come forward! I can't actually drag this. Why has it been such a dip? There we go. It's doing it a little bit now. Okay, here we go. We can bring this down because we don't need to see all of these workings here. Like so. This is going to look good. I really want to make it like a train. This will be the first time that I've actually made it look like a little bit of a train. So, here we go. And then we need, like, the funnel on top. And I'm hoping that this wood doesn't actually conflict with, um, yeah, with the wheels. hope it doesn't scrape. It shouldn't do. It really shouldn't do. No, I don't think it does at all. Oh, this is good. This is good. Okay, so we've got one minute left. The train is nearly done. Let's just bring this up here like so. Um, I want to make this look really good. What we can do as well is we can put ourselves a little bit of a tire at the front like this. And we can put... What does it need to go like? It needs to go like this. And then it needs to go up. It's probably going to be like the weirdest train that you've ever seen before. <laughs> but it should be fine. Here we go. And then we bring this down. Kind of kind of looks like a train. It's a pretty weird train, but it kind of looks like one. I think it needs, like, the funnel and stuff, so... If we bring this going down here, and we do the same on the other side, uh, like that, and then, yeah, we definitely need the funnel. So let's get up here. Uh, should we make it out of something a little bit different? Let's do some... Let's do a big sort of funnel here. We go lay it down, and bring it up like this, like so. This looks pretty good. Okay, what else does it need, Squid? <laughs> that is the worst train ever. <laughs> it doesn't even look like a funnel, does it? We've got 46 seconds. Colours! I think that's what it's missing. A load of colours. I'm probably adding a lot of unnecessary weight to this uh, train, but it's fine. Don't you worry about it. Don't you worry your face. Okay, where is the paint tool? Paint tool's here. Let's paint it blue! If we can't, blue's already engaged. Blue and red. Let's do it. Here we go. Along the other side. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's paint our train. The beast of a train. Right, we need to paint it red as well. Let's get some red colors up in here. Here we go. Oh, yes. I'm loving that we actually... I've got time to tinker with it and make it look rather pretty. Say rather pretty. It's not really the best looking train in the world. But if it wins, it would be fantastic. Oh, no, we run out of time. Ash, stop what you're doing. Stop. But yeah, yours looks sort of like a train. I like the front. I like this little front design, man. It looks pretty good. I, I don't know where it comes. I just found it. I was like, that that's train. That's that's train. That's train. That's English. Yeah. That's train. <laughs> like that's that's how it works. You see something, that's that. That's train. Done. Nice. Right. Well I'm ready that's to challenge. Train. Uh, let me just give myself a little paint jobby job. Yeah. Here. I kinda wanna carry on painting it, but I think we're wasting a little bit. Too much time. You know, I actually haven't even tested this yet. Have you not? Oh, man. That's like, not good. Yeah. You should always so. test things. I'm going to test it now. <laughs> you know. Does it work? Yeah, except my forward is... Okay. Bear. Sure. Bear. You... you... <laughs> what? Oh, wait. Your yeah. wheels aren't even on the track. I just, I just realized that I've... You the, the wheels aren't on the... <laughs> I just realized. <laughs> How could you not realize that? Oh, the horror. Well, wait, good wait. luck, man. Wait, hold on, hold on. I've got this, okay? No, no, One no. Sec. This is it. You're done. Okay, fine. I was just going to put... I was just going to, like, extend... <laughs> the, bar, <laughs> the bar moves it up and down. I'm a, I'm a <laughs> caterpillar. What? That actually, that looks pretty awesome. I'm not like that. That was it the whole time. Yeah. Okay. I, for, I, for, I forgot that I needed to make it wider. <laughs> you, you derp. Okay, I'm gonna park yours here. I'm gonna park mine to the back. <laughs> I lit. I honestly can't believe you've done that. Look at this. <laughs> okay. Right, well, my, all the best. My forward is reversed, though, which I don't get. Yeah, same. It's the same with me. I was really confused. I was like, where's, where's the forward that reverse? Okay. Sure, Duh. my caterpillar is going to do well. <laughs> I'm just turning the engines up because it's very slow. Man. I thought supposed to be slow. Yeah, they're supposed to be a slow two-two change. Yours looks, yours looks really good, though. You like shuffling on it, like... 
Oh, no. <laughs> I got some music on. <laughs> right, you ready? Yeah. Well, tool that they're ready. That's all we need for this challenge. So well, we're all clear on the rules. We've got to go past the box uh, and then pop the backs on the ba backs. Then pop the box on the back of the trailer. Go to the end and then reverse all the way back home. So basically, to get the stuff on, we just have to left click it, left click it inside the trailer, and we're done. Yep. Okay. Right. Let the train commence. <laughs> we'll do. Okay. We'll do it so your trailer has to be in line with the boxes. Okay. We, we don't pull okay, up so and then walk to it. Okay. Right, okay, so the trailer has to be at least center of the... Yeah, yeah, the yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, yeah. Right, three. let's do this, man. Let's do it. Let's do this. Let the train commence. Yes. Okay, three, two, one. Choo-choo! Choo-choo! First stop, boxes. Um, Woo! I'll be there in a minute. <laughs> just, just... Just hang on. <laughs> hang tight, mate, hang tight. J just, just hang on. I think... I think I know what the problem is. Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Not enough juice in the engine. Okay, first box in. Okay, you do your first box. That's cool. <laughs> <laughs> that is fantastic. Okay, here we go. Next. It doesn't fit. Yeah, I'm just, I'm just resting mine on the top. Look at this. I've got so much stuff in. <laughs> Why doesn't fit? Why doesn't it fit? <laughs> Done. Look at that. Okay, next one. <laughs> <laughs> get in, get on. Yes, there we go. Oh. Fuck. Oh. Oh. I like the way I'm adding sound effects as well. No, I'm derailing. I'm sort of derailing. Oh no, this is bad. I'm doing an ash. You can't, you can't do that. Why not? I'm still on. Oh no, I meant like you can't do an ash. You can't, you can't derail, man. Oh, I'm, 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 I think I've got a little bit. Right, this is so bad. I need to. I need to put it back on. Oh, this is slowing me down. I, I don't get how you pick things up like that. Like it's really weird. Okay, I'm back in line, Ash. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the? There we go. <laughs> oh dear me. I don't know how. Why mine was derailing. I think I was going too fast. Ah, yeah, I was going too fast. Oh, I've definitely done an ash again. Okay, this is fine. I'm going back. This is fine. Just need to touch. Oh, <laughs> come on. Get back on. I'm nearly there. Yeah. Come on. <laughs> He's catching up. I'm coming. No. I'm coming. Come on. Need a bit more. Come on. <laughs> come on. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Oh dear! I touched it. <laughs> Considering mine was a bit of a flop, it still works pretty well. Mate, that was the best challenge ever. Mine's like a futuristic train. This is how they're going to move in the future. <gasps> oh, you know what we could do now? What? We could do like a, another tank challenge, but with the actual um, <gasps> the yes. treads. Yes, we can. If we can get them to stick around the tire. Like if we weld them around the tire, they can be like tracks. That could be awesome. Uh, that could be legit. That could be amazing. Oh, made it. Good job, man. Hey, not a complete fail. <laughs> no, I've got to admit. I mean, I love, I love like all the luggage on the back, like mattresses. It looks like we've been moving house. <laughs> Mine didn't fit in the trailer. Like, <laughs> it was too small, so I had to just dump it. <laughs> <laughs> GG there, GG, man. That was amazing. It was good. It was really good. Yeah, it was pretty good. So... Yeah, that's been Scrap Mechanic, guys. Hope you have enjoyed. Leave a like. If you did, make sure you leave. Oh, God, I can't say. Make sure you leave. Make sure you just leave. Leave. Just leave. Leave. Just leave Take the video. Leave. I I've been recording for a week. This is my first video back, so I'm a little bit tongue-tied. So <laughs> please forgive me. No hate comments. No more. Um. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. Leave some comments in the comment section below. Leave some suggestions of what you want us to do. If you can think of any wacky ideas to do with these little welding tools by picking stuff up and stuff like that, because normally that wouldn't work. You couldn't actually pick a block up and put it in the back of your car, so that worked perfectly, so... Maybe some different challenges as well, like uh, I don't know, like football or golf or something. Something that involves, like, hitting Ooh. things. And something that's not, like, vehicle-wise, because we've done a lot of vehicle ones. Yeah. I think it'd be awesome to venture into the, the different aspects. Well, that could be pretty cool. That could be awesome. Yeah. Rocket League. Let's do Rocket League and Scrap Mechanic. Let's do it. Rocket League and Scrap Mechanics. We could probably do that. Yeah, actually. I know. We probably could with the 
the high-powered barrel cars and, and make two, two nets and stuff like that. Because you can use the staircase wedge, which is the triangle thing. Yeah. And then make a ball out of that. Yeah, and then we can use like sensors. So when it goes past like into someone's net, it can like light up or make a sound or whatever. Yes, we can. Yeah, we can definitely do that. That's, that, that Maybe that's, that could be the next challenge. So yeah, if you yeah. want us to do, a, if you want us to do a Rocket League scrum mechanic, then yeah, let us know. But yeah, that's what you guys. Hope you have enjoyed. Hope you like you did. We'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye.